My soul family, happy Monday to you. It is another work week. Hope you slept well on last night. Taking care of yourself, all right? Looking out for yourself. Um, staying in union with Holy Spirit. Listen, soul family, you were on a particular path. And the path just didn't look like it was the right path. There were many obstacles that you were facing on this path. So you took a detour and you decided, I'm going to take a different path to see if I can um, see something a little different. Holy Spirit had already shown you what was to come of your path, of your journey. All right. You had sat with Holy Spirit. You sat in stillness. And Holy Spirit had revealed to you your course, revealed to you your mission, all right? And you started out down that path. Well, there was turbulence on the path. There was obstacles on the path. And it just didn't look like you were on the right path. So you took a detour and you went down another path. As you were going down that particular path, it started out looking pretty good. Like, hey, I'm on the right path. This is what I'm supposed to be doing. And then all of a sudden, the storm comes and literally wipes that path out. Okay? This tsunami-like, tornado-like event comes. This tower moment comes and wipes out that path. The path is gone literally is gone so you're on the detour path and you're sitting there in devastation all right you're sitting there wondering what am i going to do now and you're realizing the path that you were on even though there was a little bit of turbulence was actually the right path okay it was actually the right path all right. You didn't recognize it because you assumed that the path that Holy Spirit, thank you, Holy Spirit, was taking you on was free of obstacles, that it was going to be a lot easier, that you weren't going to have to grow. Thank you, Holy Spirit, that you weren't going to have to challenge yourself. You thought it was going to be a lot easier. And when it wasn't, you decided to take a path that looked like it was going to be easier but it ended up being harder and it was more devastating when that path was literally wiped out, okay? So family, yes, that path was wiped out. And I said this to you on my downloads yesterday, one of my downloads yesterday or the day before, there are multiple paths we take, all right? There is no wrong path because each path is gonna lead you to the path that Holy Spirit has already revealed to you in your, in your quiet time. Every path leads you to that particular path. And the multiple paths are there as an option. But Holy Spirit knows exactly uh, what is taking place. Sometimes you are not matured enough to see that the original path that you were on was the right one. Sometimes you're not in touch with your inner knowing enough. Sometimes there is confusion and you really do think, okay, this path that I'm on is not the right path. This is not what Holy Spirit showed. This is not the best for me. This is not for my highest good. There's something better. Let me go get it. All right. You really do believe you're not just inadvertently dropping the original path. You feel like you you have justifiable reasons for moving away from that path, okay? But when you take the other path, Holy Spirit comes in again, all right? Because the goal is to get you back on the original path, to connect you back to the original message that you received, and also to teach you to trust your inner knowing. You could always go back to that uh, other path. This is what I want you to understand, soul family. No one, Holy Spirit isn't going to look at you in shame, all right, because you took a detour. People do that. Holy Spirit doesn't do that. 
because you had to turn around and go back. People look at you in shame and embarrassment, not Holy Spirit. So trust that Holy Spirit is guiding you back to something. Only you know what that something is. And that you haven't lost an opportunity, thank you Holy Spirit, for whatever is on that path. Whatever was there before is still there now. Thank you, Holy Spirit. But you have to align with that. And you've got to be willing to grow. You've got to be willing uh, to do whatever it is on that path that it takes to get you to what Holy Spirit showed you. What did Holy Spirit show you? Whatever Holy Spirit show you, it is showed you, it is still in effect. You did not declare it null and void when you stepped off the path. It's still on that path. But you have to be willing to go through whatever it takes, okay, to realize that vision. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Because Holy Spirit showed it to you. And Holy Spirit never just shows us things. Holy Spirit shows us truth. The truth of our mission. What we're supposed to be doing. All right. And Holy Spirit will come in. There will be a removal of paths. There will be a removal of people. There will be a removal of jobs. All of this is to get your attention. If some of you are going through devastating losses right now, the Holy Spirit is trying to get your attention. Get back to the original path and everything you need is on that original path. So family, have a fantastic day and I'll see you on the next download. Toodles.